What is up guys? Happy Monday and more importantly, Happy New Year. I am filming this video on January 2nd. I felt like, you know what? I should make this video on January 1st, but I spent the day relaxing with my family instead. My most important family, but you guys are my second family. You're my second most important family. And so you guys get the second day of the year. So I wanna to talk to you guys a little bit about big picture, about the big picture of 2023. So I'm gonna talk about what is our mission? What are our values? What is our goal for the year? Um, uh, really the first three months. And what are the three key factors that we're gonna focus on at Steel Strength Training this year? So number one, our mission at Steel Strength Training is to change as many lives as possible through strength training, all right? Next is values, all right? This is both the way that we approach things mentally, how we're thinking about things, but also how we act, okay? So our values influence both our thought process and our action. These are the values that, as a team, we abide by, that we follow, okay? First is faith. Um, so I talk about this a lot, but I'm a Christian and I love Jesus. And so faith is the most important thing in my life. And so uh, it can't help but uh, influence my business. And so um, I always want to make decisions based on my faith, based on what I believe. Um, and so ultimately, I wanna glorify God. Now, uh, I tell myself, look, you don't have to be a Christian to be here, but what I do want for you is to believe that we're all here for a reason, that there's a purpose, that there's a plan for steel string training and that we're part of something bigger than ourselves. And the second thing with faith is that uh, I want us to be a faithful steward of the people and the projects in front of us. You see, I spent my early years in business constantly operating out of pride or fear. Um, but now I try my best um, to, to operate by trusting that God has a plan for us. And the second thing is to be faithful. You see, uh, I think that many people are either can fall on the lazy end of the spectrum and other people fall into that hustle grind burnout stage. And to be honest, I really struggled with this. I, I felt like I was con constantly needed to be working. Uh, I, I didn't make enough time for rest. And so I teetered on that edge of burnout. And so what I tell my staff is don't hustle, don't grind, and don't be lazy. Let's work hard, but let's be faithful with the people and the projects in front of us. Do good work, but once the work is done, rest and relax and know that ultimately it's not in your hands. The second thing is health. Of course, we are helping people with their health, all right? We do strength training, we talk about nutrition, we talk about cardio and lifestyle and sleep and reducing stress. We are trying to improve your physical health, but we also wanna prioritize both our own and the clients, that's you, uh, all aspects of your health, your spiritual health, yes, your physical health, but your emotional health, your mental health, your uh, social health, your financial health. We think all of these things, uh, ultimately we want them to get to a place of health. And so while we primarily focus on the physical, there are repercussions with what we do, um, working to improve your physical health that trickle over into the other areas of life and vice versa. As you get those things in line, as you get those things healthy, they're going to improve your physical health. Um, but I always tell my staff, look, I want to prioritize not just my own health, my family's health, but also your health. I want to take care of them. Um, and I, I appreciate it when they do that for me in return. The next is family, okay? Uh, number one, I like to see uh, staff members prioritizing their own families. For me, that's taking care of my wife and my kids and loving them and being present for them and, and seeking to serve them uh, every day, right? Um, but the second thing is, and, and I like to see my staff members doing the same, but you guys, the clients, Steel Strength Training, this is my second family. I want it to feel like family here. And so uh, I tell myself all the time, I want to treat the clients like family. I want this to be your family away from home. Um, and so that, that bleeds into this, which I'll talk about in a second, but those are our core values, all right? I just want you guys, wanted to share that with you guys. The next is the goal, plain and simple. As we're changing your lives, we'd like to change as many lives as possible. And so my first goal for the year is for us to change 125 lives by the end of March, okay? So we're at 95 right now. I would like for us to add 30 clients, that's a net of 10 per month, uh, between now and March, end of March. 
The last thing, these are the three key factors that I'm gonna make sure we don't lose sight of. These are things that you know I've wavered on in past years, not in 2022. We did a great job as a team focusing on these things. However, in past year, years, I have wavered from these things and the results were not good. And so these are three of the main things that really set us apart here at Steel Strength Training. So we are always, always gonna focus on strength training, personal training, and a personal relationship with each client. We wanna make sure that we're focusing on progressive overload and getting stronger because we know that when you get stronger, every other area of your health and fitness will improve. Uh, we know that personal training is very beneficial even when done in our small group setting because you have individual needs. And while there's a lot of overlap, a lot of similarities between each of us, we also have unique goals unique issues that we're dealing with, injuries, things like that, health issues. And so it's very important that things are personalized. And then the last thing is a personal relationship with each client. You are not just a number. Of course, you're part of the uh, 125 clients that we want to get to, but we never want you to feel like a number. We want to love you and serve you and care for you. We want you to know that we love you as a person, as an individual. We want a personal relationship with you watching this camera. Um, and hopefully, if you're already part of Steel, you've already felt that. Um, and if not, let me know, because we're gonna change that immediately, like right now. So this, I just wanted to share with you guys my heart, my goals, my vision for the future. Uh, I am very excited for 2023 and what's gonna happen here at Steel Strength Training. Thank you for being a part of it. And if you have friends or family members whose lives would also be changed by being here, please refer them, bring them, we would love to work with them as well.